Fans of Samsung's Galaxy Note series have been kept waiting thanks to the Note 7's battery issues. Here's what's changed since then with the new Galaxy Note 8. On the front of the Galaxy Note 8, you'll immediately notice that the Infinity display has pushed away a home button. With an aspect ratio of 18.5 to 9, the Note 8 is almost one centimeter longer than its predecessor. This extra length is also heightened by the somewhat narrower housing of the Note 8 compared to the Note 7. Underneath the hood, the Note 8 contains a 3300 mAh battery, which is quite conservative for a device of this size. The battery in the thinner predecessor was 200 mAh more, but we all know what that led to. Aside from the display and the size of the device, the changes aren't so extreme. On the bottom, there's still the S Pen stylus slot, a loudspeaker, microphone, USB Type-C port, headphone jack, and even the antenna lines have barely moved. The back of the phone is where things got revamped a little. Instead of a simple camera, the Note 8 now has a dual camera. Each camera has 12 megapixels, and one has a 26 mm focal length, and the other has 52 mm. As with the S8 and S8 Plus, the fingerprint scanner has been placed beside the camera module on the back. This is pretty inconvenient, as it's quite a stretch to reach it. Like its predecessor, the Note 8 is protected against dust and water by an IP68 certification, and the front of the Super AMOLED display is protected by Gorilla Glass 5. The phone is powered by a Snapdragon 835 processor, which we already know from the S8 and S8 Plus. What the Note 8 does have more of, though, is RAM, which has been upgraded to 6GB instead of 4GB. The internal memory is now up to 256GB. Let us know what you think of the changes in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe.